Hi guys, Roshan Curie here and you're very welcome to another sketching video. In today's video, I'm going to share with you a few tips on how to get loads of sketching done while you're on holiday, whilst still being sociable and taking part in all the fun things that you want to do when you're there. So here are my 10 sketching opportunities for us hopelessly addicted sketchers. Number one, over a leisurely breakfast. Sitting in Marina Rubicon in the south of Lanzarote over delicious Mediterranean breakfast was absolutely gorgeous and a lovely way to start our holiday together. Number two, go and find somewhere that you both have something to enjoy and to look at. For us, the cactus garden in the north of the island was the perfect place for both of us to have loads of cool things to look at and enjoy. Number three, if it's just so beautiful that you nobody can deny you the chance to sketch it and this beautiful view over an island in the north of Lanzarote was just too good to ignore. This is a really good one. Number four, on the beach when your companion is having a swim. You never know, they might be gone for ages and then you'll be able to get your sketching in. And when they come back, they might just like nothing better than to jump into the book they're reading. That was a great opportunity for me to get this very lively sketch of people on the beach done. Number six, quick sketch over coffee. Another one in the Marina Rubicon of these boats in the Marina and on tinted paper, there wasn't much in the way of color to add, which saved me a bit of time. Number seven, nipping down for the last swim of the day. When I got there, it was a bit cold, so I figured I would do a sketch of our hotel instead. Number eight, there may be times when you are ready to bounce out of bed and get down to the day, get it started. Well, that's me. I'm a morning person by and large. Um, and sometimes that's not always the case for the people I'm traveling with. Or they might have a little bit of work to do. You never know. Either way, there is sometimes a couple of hours on the either in the morning or late into the evening when you will be free to do as you wish. Number nine, my husband and I were chilling out on the seashore on the east coast of the island. And it was all so glorious and so crashy and so wavy and so divine that really it was just too good to miss. Number 10, lastly, you sketch when you really want to. And you figure that your travelling companion stroke companions are grown-ups and can go and amuse themselves. So that's it. Little crab to keep you company. Thank you so much for watching and I wish you luck with finding moments to sketch while you're on halls with your loved ones. See you next time.